What's going on guys? Joe here for Gamer Toys and welcome back to another pickup episode. I know, it has been forever. It's been over a month now, I think, since my last video. Life just kind of gets in the way and kind of takes priority over YouTube and with a wife and three kids, my life can get really busy very quickly. So I apologize for you guys who've been waiting for that content. The giveaway is still coming. I plan on doing that very soon. But um, let's run down some of these modern pickups real quick and uh, we'll get more into that later. I forgot that these bad boys were even out. And this is the uh, Legacy Collection re-release of the Automorphin Power Rangers. So I picked up Jason and Tommy. I thought these were the only two that were out until I looked on the back of the box here. And uh, right here by my finger, you can see Kimberly. I haven't seen her in the store yet. These Zords also look pretty cool. But yeah, so we have Jason here. Uh, he comes with his, his blade blaster and his power sword, uh, just like the vintage, which I have back here. I don't know what the back of the card looks like, and I don't plan on opening these, so I'm not even sure if the back of the card is the same or if the back of the card looks something like this. I don't know. I don't really collect modern Power Rangers. These, I'll definitely hold on to. And then we got Tommy, the same card. Uh, it comes with his dragon shield, the dragon dagger, and the blade blaster, which he never had in the show, but that's okay, we let it slide, Bandai. Uh, shows the same, you know, it's morphing time. Here's how you morph them in case you forgot in the last 20 plus years. Awesome figure. I scored the entire third wave. I don't know if this is wave three or four, honestly. But I got, um, you know, the phenomenal one AJ Styles here. It's cool that they're finally including them with little stands. So this is AJ in his blue, uh, you know, the black and blue tights with the blue gloves. There's not really any detail on the gloves, but that's all right. Cool figure. They have his AJ tattoo. And on the back of the card, shows his action. Uh, hit the phenomenal forearm. But it's basically... It's basically just a clothesline. Shows the rest of the wave, Seth, Dean, and Goldberg. Next up, Seth Rollins. Pretty sweet figure, also comes with a stand. He's in his black and gray attire. Shows his action on the back. Push down on Seth's torso and deliver a pedigree. Does Seth do a, a fist to the back move called the pedigree? I, I don't know. I guess I don't pay attention enough. Goldberg. Now I thought Goldberg might be kind of a harder one to find. Found him easily. These three were the easiest to find. We'll get to this guy in a second. Goldberg is cool. Comes with his tribal tattoo on the stand. He's wearing his uh, WWE style attire with the shorts pushed down on his torso and it launches into a spear. I don't know if that looks like a spear, but that's okay. Uh, still a cool figure, mouth wide open. Glad to add Goldberg to the collection. And last up for this episode, Dean Ambrose. This guy right here. Mr. Dean Ambrose was the hardest one for me to find. I originally found all four of these at Target. In my mind, I put all four into, you know, the basket to go check out. And we're putting, you know, the stuff that we bought in the car. I realized that I only have the three. There's no Dean. Apparently, I never put Dean in the basket. And then a couple weeks after that, I go back. There he is, the only one there. The card's a little wavy. Corner is a little pushed up, but it's okay. I don't really care that much because these cards are super flimsy. But I'm glad to have Dean into the collection now to complete this wave. All right, guys. So that's going to do it for this episode of Pickups. I got the current wave of retro WWE figures and two out of the three Legacy Collection re-release Automorph figures. All right, so I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, stay tuned for the giveaway video. I'll be putting that out as soon as I can. Sorry for the delay. I'm going to try and get back into the swing of things. I'm not really getting out to the stores as much lately, and I definitely haven't been hitting up any toy shows or any vintage stores to try and find retro goodness, but I'm um, trying to get back in the swing of things. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.